everybody, my name is Little Uni, and welcome to Animal Jam. I recorded an episode of Animal Jam yesterday because, um, because I wanted to even out the whole Pop Tropica thing, too. Um, and it was completely boring because there was no update yesterday, so I didn't know what to do. Um, so, I'm just gonna quickly go over the newspaper with you guys. Um, August 15th is National Honey Bee Day, and I am so excited for this, you guys. There are pet honeybees here! Ooh, we can just, like, adopt one right here. That's weird. <laughs> um, but yeah, pet honeybees are finally here. Well, I mean, we weren't expecting them, but they're adorable, so of course they're finally here. Um, I'm definitely going to get one. And there's a den item contest. We can choose between glitchy gear, the movie theater, or the steampunk parlor. I chose movie theater because it seems like something that I would use the most, especially with that popcorn and candy stand and the big old TV. That would be so cool. And the beta party is back and snow leopards are coming back. And I think that's all the news for today. Let's open this back up and immediately adopt a pet honeybee because I... I'm so excited for these little guys. I want one that is totally... Actually, now I thought I wanted one that was totally yellow, but let's have it like this. Oh, they are just so cute. Oh my goodness. I am absolutely in love with pet honeybees, and they're for non-members too, so for those of you who haven't been online yet today, they are for non-members, and they are one of the cutest pets in Animal Jam, in my opinion. Okay, let's choose a pattern. Oh, so fluffy. <laughs> I want the fluffy, because he kind of... Oh, no, wait, no, there's actually other things that I didn't even see. I have horrible luck with bees in real life, but they're so adorable when they like like when they look like this. Oh, you can be all sparkly. I want mine carrying a bucket of honey, because that's just adorable. I want normal wings. Let's see, antenna. Oh, they can have none. That's cute. I kind of like it when it's squiggly like this, because he kind of looks like that he's been hitting windows or something. Okay. <clears throat> Jelly boy. Perfect. <laughs> okay, yeah, I need to set free a pet. Hmm, which pet should I set free? Uh, let's set free Go Hamster. Bye bye, Go Hamster. Awesome. We now have an adorable little bee. Okay, let's see what the bees do. So you kind of. They just kind of fly around. Animal Jim's been a little bit lazy with that kind of stuff, but I don't mind because pet honeybees are the cutest pets ever. Okay, let's go dress him up because he needs his little thing of, what's it called? Thing of honey. Okay. Oh, they can have a little cup of juice. Oh, this is so cute. But I want him carrying the honey. Oh, and a bow. We could be a little drag queen. So adorable. Okay. Oh, I love that cute little helmet, too. And a little flower. And some headphones. <clears throat> and a mohawk, of course. I kind of like the little flower, even though it's a boy. Doesn't even matter. Okay, I think I'm just going to do... Go with the honey. He is so awesome. Oh, best pet ever. I wonder if they're actually uh, <clears throat> being sold here. It would be cool if there was like a whole entire building dedicated to having a bunch of bees. <gasps> oh, that would be awesome. It would be like, it, it, it could be, it should be <laughs> just another tree. <clears throat> Sorry, I'm like, 
freaking out, and I don't know why. It would just be like a tree, and you go inside the tree, and it's like all beautiful and golden because of the honey, and you can, and it's kind of like when you track through mud, you get all yellow. When you go in there, and there are bees everywhere, it would kill every computer, but it would be so amazing, and the Mojam needs to do that. <laughs> I'm all out of breath because these bees, these bees, man, they're just, they're amazing. I don't know why I love the bees so much. I just do. They are so cool. I need to calm down. <laughs> I shouldn't be freaking out this much over bees. Actually, bees kind of support the earth in the most important way. I wonder if they're being sold in the wild anywhere. No, there's a bee's nest up here. Nope. They're not being sold here. This is where every bee lives. Woo! Are these just facts? Yeah, they're just facts. Oh my god, trypophobia. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> okay. I wonder if the beta party's on, because even though, yeah, it's on, even though I've already been to it, there might be new stuff in the stores. Oh my god, imagine if this was like a time portal. <laughs> Everyone's just here for this stuff. Even though the stuff in the beta party is of no worth whatsoever, it's still fun to look at it. You know? Because it's kind of in the same art style. That's cool. So cute. <laughs> Whew. <laughs> I'm all tired now because of all my freaking out. Why can't I not go up? What? That made no sense. But still. Oh, it's so hard to navigate with the arrow keys. My arrow keys are so tiny, but I'm so glad that I have all of them. For those of you that don't know, I, um, my last computer didn't have any, what's it called, arrow keys. I'm pretty sure this monkey statue is new, because I don't remember it being here last time. Ooh, a puddle! Awesome. <laughs> I never noticed this puddle right here. Anyways, so, it's Thursday, right? Yeah, it's Thursday. Hmm. Let's go to Epic Wonders. I love Epic Wonders so much. Epic Wonders is the best. Okay, we're here. Yay! Here, you guys. Also, in the in the episode that I recorded on my own, this kind of looks like a vanity, but it's like, it's a sink. There is a sink right here. Why? Why is there a sink on a vanity? I mean, what? I don't even know if that's a thing, but I've never heard of it before. So of course it must not be real. <laughs> wow, it's been ten minutes already, you guys. Well, it's almost been ten minutes. It's been nine minutes. But it's almost been ten minutes. I spent half of this video freaking out over my new pet bee. But the pet bee is so cute. He's just so cute. Oh, I just want to give him all the pets. Yes, I do. Okay, we need to put him out in the den somewhere. I'm gonna go to my den. Oh, what? These are my buddies? No. <laughs> I don't want to talk to people, and I can't talk to people because I'm doing a video. Ugh. I want to go put the bee. 
I want to put the bee in my den and I can't because no one will leave. Oh, I like that bee. Good job, you mysterious bunny that I didn't get to read your name. It was Rosie and then something that started with an S. Rosie sh 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 Shy Star. <laughs> I gotta see her name. <laughs> oh my god. That'd be so amazing. I don't know what I'm doing. Can non-members have the same amount of uh, of pets as members? Because now I'm curious. I have this idea in my head. I, ha I have it on my head. Wow, English. Amazing. I, I have this idea in my head that, that I could, you know, like, if non-members can have all the same pet slots, then you could just get nothing but bees and have a bee's nest den. And it would be so cool. Everything would be yellow. Everything would just be so cool. But I don't think you could do that as a non-member because, you know, it would just be like, it would just be blah. You know? Blah. Ah, I wish no one would have my den. It's so frustrating. It's annoying. Oh my god, there's something at the lower bar of, or of my computer that you guys can't see that was bothering me too. <laughs> That's why I was so angry, because it was like, there was something out that I wasn't using, and it wouldn't go away. What is up with, like, non-members and being purple and blue? Why is everyone doing that all of a sudden? They're like the color of juice. I, I just don't get it. Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done screaming about everything. I've spent like three minutes doing that. No. There you go. I love this little hats corner. I like how they have all the hats out like this. They should do that with everywhere. It's kind of annoying to have the same stuff to look at all the time. And it's kind of funny how they smushed in the monkey hat like that. It's kind of cute. Monkey hat. Monkey hat. A do 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 do. We should buy a monkey hat because they're so cute and you've got the little tongue right there. Oh my god. I don't know if you guys can see this right now, but my screen is derping. There we go. I fixed it. I usually have to like poke around the screen on the back of it. Oh my god, it would look amazing. <sighs> okay. <laughs> <clears throat> Alright, let's, let's put our fox hat back on. There we go. I don't know why we bought that monkey hat, but we did. Pretty cool in my opinion. I'm gonna pause the video for a second. Okay, you guys, I've been wandering around Animal Jam, and finally, no one is at my den. So now we can go in there. And I looked through some of my jamograms, and someone sent me a beehive, which is perfect. We are gonna set out the beehive somewhere in my den and put our new pet bee. I think his name is Jelly Boy, but I don't completely remember. Um. Oh, but I am so excited about putting this in, and I don't think Animal Jam is going to load at all. Ugh, I will refresh the page. Oh, yeah, I refresh the page. I still hope no one's at my den, though, because then they'll try to talk to me, and it'll be awful. <laughs> if you guys can't tell already, I don't like talking to people in Animal Jam while I'm recording. Oh, I'm finally here. Good. We're going to put a beehive somewhere. Somewhere out in the wild. Ooh, maybe up in that tree? No. No, it needs to be somewhere easily accessible. Maybe on, like, the edge of the rocks there. Because that is where I put all my pets. So it would kind of fit to have Jelly be up there with his hive. Oh. 
It just kind of just kind of wiggles there. Yeah, it kind of looks like it's floating there, although the honey drip is perfect because it kind of looks like the honey drip is going behind the rocks, which is really awesome, but I feel like that it needs to be somewhere else. He can be hanging from that thing there. Now, let's, let's find a place. Let's see. Maybe somewhere... Maybe there's somewhere that it can hang from over here. Not really, because, I mean, a palm tree would be kind of good, but there's nowhere to put a beehive. It's it's a pretty tree and all, but there's nowhere to put it. Um, maybe I could have it dangling off of here. Like, uh, off of the bottom of this deck right here. Well, it kind of doesn't really fit there. Yeah, it still looks like that it's floating. It needs somewhere really good to dangle from. Ooh, way up here. No, I'm just kidding. I almost thought maybe somewhere over here, but the way it wiggles, that doesn't look like that it goes. I want it to be somewhere on the main island and not off on a different island. Well, no, that goes, that just goes behind it. Would be perfect, but it's not. Oh, it could be over here. No, but the, it would be too, it's too low. It now really does look like it's floating by a lot. Maybe somewhere over in Teensy Tiny Moon's Playhouse. Oh, hey, we're on this rim right here. Hmm. No, it's not, it's just not a good place on a building. No, that doesn't work either, because it just goes behind it. I'll try the building again. No, because it doesn't work that way. This den is horrible for a bee's nest. And I don't know why I'm so upset about that, because I don't like having bees near me. No, that doesn't fit. It's too big. Now then, Teensy, uh, not Teensy, Rosie Icy Bird would have honey drip down on her all day. That would just be awful. I mean, honey is delicious, but... It's like, no, you don't want that all over you, especially when you're trying to sleep. There is no good place to put it. I'm gonna, there's not even a place over on the other island. Well, I'll look anyways. Where are you, other island? We need you. Oh, is this the other island? Yeah. I mean, there kind of is a, ch there kind of is a cherry tree. There's definitely a cherry tree right here. I mean, it kind of goes. A little bit. Okay, this works. I would prefer it to be not here. That's fine. Can't be dependent on your baby. Stupid thing. Oh, this is taking ages. Let's just start walking. <laughs> We're gonna unequip him and put him over here in the den. I love how all the bees fly around. I wish that they would be flying around like that constantly, but it's only sometimes, and that's really awful. Waiting. There we go. I can't unequip! There we go. <laughs> I was getting so impatient because it was taking ages for it to scroll down. So I just clicked it a bunch, clicked the arrow a bunch, and then it just wouldn't stop clicking itself. There we go. 
He doesn't exactly fit in with the rest of the bees, but that's fine. Fitting in is awful anyways. <laughs> It kind of looks like they're all swerving around him every time they, they go behind him. Because they go so fast, you know? I think I'm going to have to end this episode here. I'm sorry it's a little shorter than usual, but only by a couple minutes. I'm just so happy to finally, like, to have this be with us. It's amazing. <laughs> so, I hope you all have a wonderful day. And I hope to see you in the comments in one of my videos. Bye bye